Hi there, my name is Amanda Hill and in this video we're going to show you one of the little hidden gems in PayHip, which is a fantastic program that you can use to sell digital downloads and courses and varying other things. Now this little hidden gem that creates these fantastic pages is actually hiding behind a few buttons. So let's go and take a look and see where it is. So when you create your products in PayHip, they sit in a particular space, which is here. Now this one is officially launching today, but it's the only one out of the three that's actually a proper course. So by going into manage, you can actually create that lovely page. Now you need to do that because when you share it, it gives the page for the product and everything about it. Now it's built very similar to WordPress. So if you've ever used WordPress, then this is going to be an absolute doddle for you. So here you can see all the different sections that are part of this course. And if you click, you can actually go into each one and do some changes. You can also make changes over here and you can also duplicate pages. So by just clicking through, let me show you what you can see. So let's just click on this one. And you can actually change all of the content on here, as well as whatever is in the lesson. However, what you also need to do is take note of these settings up here. These give you settings and the pages and the pricing. And you can also drip it and publish it. So if you go and check on the pages, this will not only give you the sales landing page that you can edit, which is here, and I'll go into it in a second, but it also gives you the checkout page, which you can view, and the thank you page, which you can edit. So both of those are a really good thing to do. And if you just click on edit here, you'll see what I mean about how simple the layout is. So the header is exactly what it says. It's the header. The um, section here is mainly the title. Then you're going down the blocks. So each section relates to a different part. So let's just take a look at one of them. So this one is the title here and I can change it and put whatever I want. I can put a link behind it. <clears throat> now this one here where it says background, that's this picture behind here. And if you click on that, you can actually change not only the picture, but the overlay and the color scheme. So this is the picture that I've added and this changes how dark or how light the overlay is. You can also change to different colour schemes. There's a lot that you can do with this and when you've done, save your changes and click publish. Otherwise, whatever you've done, won't save. Then you can just click back and it takes you to other sections. Now I realised on the courses that on the main page for the web for all of the products, it doesn't actually put the pricing. So I've added it to the course page title and then people can see it. Now, if you wanted a subscription model for anything that you're doing, you can add in a subscription page as well. However, you will need to enable Stripe to be paid for that. PayPal, as yet on PayHip, doesn't have the capacity to do that. 
to get out of where you are, you literally click to the left to the little hamburger and you click Exit Store Builder. Make sure on your course that you've added something in the pricing section, otherwise they can't see what's going to be on your page. So this is where you can add your pricing plans and they can be one-time purchases or they can be on subscription. You can have varying different prices and dependent on what your settings are set at, it will add VAT at the end. Hence, I've shown mine differently to the top. So it's very simple. You just need to know where to look. I remember there's always things hiding up here too. This is a fantastic program that I'm sure you will love creating digital or real products with. I think our next one might be a subscription model. Who knows? I hope you've enjoyed this and it has helped you.